and welcome back to Breath of Fire. Uh, today we are going to meddle. We're gonna meddle super, super hard in other people's affairs. As a child, a ten-year-old, tries to get two adults to hook up. Uh, it's up to you just wait and see, Iggy. For long I'll have it all, the Gil, Shaddis, how can they resist a first-rate guy like me, huh? Because you're an ass. Sup? Say bed. You're in love with Shaddis, aren't you? What? What are you talking about? Don't be so embarrassed. I'm sure Shaddis likes you too. Wait, wait just a minute. Why don't we talk about this somewhere else? What are you talking about? Of course I like Shadis, she's my friend, but... P -p 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 Propose? I, I can't do that! I mean, I'm nothing! She needs someone strong and, 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 and reliable to help run the guild! So then you just need to get strong. No, oh, I, I don't know. I think that's easier said than done, look at me. No, oh, no problem. Just teach you some magic. We'll help train you. Train? Oh boy. Yeah, first you go and apprentice yourself to Bunyan, uh, then you chop logs, then you beat up monsters, and the next thing you know, you're strong. That's how I did it. So we'll help you get stronger as we wait for the boat to come. Just let me get into the fucking lighthouse. You won't know unless you try, babe. I'm going back to work. Well, that didn't go as planned. Nothing ever does in this game. It may take him some time to face the truth here. What's all that noise about? Oh, I can only guess. Bade, what's going on? Zig's going to fix the lighthouse. Good luck. If Zig manages to defeat the monsters and repair the lighthouse, then there'd be no denying that he's the strongest man around and the choice for, for Guildmaster. And that means Zig will marry Shadis, right? Please, I want you to train me. I can't just give up, not without trying. Please train me. Make me strong so I can go fix the lighthouse before Zig. Can't we just go fix the lighthouse? Never used a sword before. You'll have to get me some equipment. I'll give you a thousand zenny, so please get me some armor and a sword. Please get some that aren't too heavy. So I think if you just have equipment, uh, then this happens for free. I don't actually know what equipment I have in stock, but I don't think I have any weapons I particularly want to give him right now. Uh, well, just, you know what? I could give him the ball knife. I have a bracer and some dana and a waist cloth. Honestly, that's probably fine for him. Please get me some equipment. <coughs> I can use anything Ryu can. Got it. All right, then. Are you ready to start training? Ready. I'll come when I finished work, so please wait for me in the town square. We've got a new ally. <laughs> His name is Bade, and I don't think he's going to be very good. Thanks for waiting. No one should bother us here. Let's get started. Could you please give me the equipment you have for me? Okay. So we need to equip Bade. We're gonna give him a ball knife. Oh, he already has zero agility. Then what was the point in telling him? Oh, whatever. We're gonna give him a ball knife. Oh, he doesn't actually equip anything else. Well, then we're gonna give him a waist cloth as well. 
Mm, I'm tempted to go ahead and give him the freaking Claymore since he already has zero defense, but uh, I don't think I'm going to get it back. I should probably give him somewhat better equipment, but whatever. Once you're ready to begin, let me know. Oh, we're ready. Okay, so I can change my members, I can change Bade's equipment. How are we doing this, Bade? Alright, I'll explain how this works. Here's how it works. First off, to raise my defense, attack me when I'm defending. I do a lot of damage. My defense will go up according to the number of times I'm attacked. Since I don't have that many HP to begin with, I'll be defending a lot, so be sure to go after me then. <laughs> if I attack and hit, my power will go up, and how much it goes up depends on how much damage I do. I'll always go after the person with the lowest defense. Based on how much damage I take, my maximum HP will go up. I can heal during a fight, so try to make the fight last as long as possible. That's the best way to make me stronger faster. The training session will end when the remaining turns meter on the top reaches zero, or when he runs out of HP. All of you or I are knocked out. Okay. So, did you follow all that? Let me know when you're ready to start. Okay. Sure. Uh, yeah. Let's go. Come and get me. So, I don't think I want to be hitting him with Ryu. Because that'll do a lot of damage to him. He's not defending. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just attack you. I wonder if I can steal from him. Uh, and let's... Identify, why not? Okay, yeah, he does not have a whole lot of HP, so I really don't want to hit him with Ryu. He got none. Got it. Okay. So he's hitting me. Uh, he didn't do a whole lot of damage, so his attack didn't go up very much, though. Hmm, we're gonna hit him with Nina again. And let's... I'm pretty sure a double blow will straight up kill him. Blind might do a small amount of damage and... Well, you know what? Let's protect him. How about that? And let's heal him up as well. Because the more damage I do to him, the more... The higher his max HP is going to be. But the more times I hit him, the more defense he's going to get. So I don't want to kill him, but I do want to hurt him. And I want him to be able to actually hurt me. Why are you attacking Ryu? Ryu does not have the lowest amount of defense. That would be like Nina. You want to be hitting Nina, not Ryu. What are you doing? Okay. Nina, keep hitting him. Ryu. Ryu, you're going to kill him if you ever actually attack him. Hmm... Let's try a double blow. I think that's probably gonna take him out, but you know what? Yeah, it's just gonna take him out. Let's, def you know what? No, don't defend, examine, examine. I should probably just set Momo to healing this guy on every turn. Attack, examine, and heal. See, this would be a good time to be using um, he did give me the option of changing my party members. This would probably be a good time to be using Kiko, uh, or using, uh, Final Gambit, or whatever the hell it's called, uh, to lower my defense to zero. Uh, that way he's doing more damage to me, and therefore gaining more, uh, gaining more attack. I'm just going to keep smacking him over and over with Nina until he's almost dead. 
Okay, I think we see how this battle is gonna go. I'm pretty sure I have to do this multiple times. Uh, so I think we're just gonna skip ahead a little bit here. Okay, so I had overestimated this guy uh, and accidentally KO'd him on like level 10. This is a multi-night draining thing, I believe. Uh, he keeps saying, give him the lightest stuff possible, give him the lightest stuff possible. I think that's a lie. So I'm gonna go ahead and give him the Claymore. Uh, so that he'll actually do more damage. And I'm gonna go ahead and give him the Breastplate so he can take a hit. Uh, now the problem with that is, I don't think I get that equipment back. But, you know what? I don't think it's going to be... I think the changes to his stats are going to be enough reason to do this. I also weakened myself through my equipment quite a bit. Uh, so let's go ahead and give this another shot. I'm going to do pretty much the same strat. Hit him with Nina uh, over and over again to lower his defense. Or to lower his attack. Sorry, to lower his HP. Heal him up with... Uh, Momo, I still don't think he can take a hit from Ryu at all, frankly. Um, oh, yeah. attack with Nina. Ryu, go ahead and protect him. And Momo, then heal him up afterwards. Oh yeah, Ryu is really fast now because I took off all of his really heavy stuff. Okay, so now a critical from Nina is doing 17, whereas a regular hit from her was doing about 15 before. And now he's actually doing damage to me. Cool. So, this is what I needed to actually be happening. I needed to give him better equipment. Now, I'm gonna just go ahead and continue like I was before in hurting this guy repeatedly to train him up and make him stronger. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna stick with this one. Just got a reprisal on like with only two or three turns left. I, I think I'm just gonna stick with this one. Honestly, that got a lot farther than expected. Yeah, I did. I did a lot of damage to him. Successful blocks and defense was zero. Okay, so he does need to be dealing damage to me in order to increase his power. Ah. Uh, so I can get to the lighthouse and repair it before Zig. I'll see you again tomorrow night. Okay. I think I get healed in between this, because I used up a lot of MP, because I was healing him every turn. Um, I did get healed. Okay, cool. Oh, that's not actually what I wanted to do. I think I still have... Yeah, I still have the $1,000 that he gave me. Now, one thing I can do is I can pick up new equipment, or different equipment, I should say. And I can switch around equipment uh, on him at pretty much before I start any training session. I can switch his equipment out. Uh, I can also switch which characters that I'm gonna have. Well, obviously, Ryu always has to be there, but uh, since he likes to hit Ryu anyway, one thing I can do is remove the things that would be increasing my defense. Uh, that way, when he's hitting me, it will be doing more damage. At this point, it might be okay to go ahead and have Ryu. Let's go ahead and switch back to normal formation. And with normal formation, it might actually be okay for me to hit him with Ryu. Um, I am gonna save though, now that I've gotten a somewhat successful run with this guy. Don't need to heal at all. Still don't want to hit him with Momo. Momo's going to do way too much damage to him. Uh, let's go ahead and save. And then I guess I'll move into a second training session. Uh, this point in the game is a little bit of a drag, but eh, it's unfortunately necessary. All right. You ready to train again? Start training. Oh, I can also say just let's go to the lighthouse. Okay, I don't know how many days I have to do this with him. I mean, 
I would prefer to just do the lighthouse myself right now, but whatever. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and just do this. And let's see what he can take now that I'm no longer in attack formation with Ryu. I think I should be able to hit him at least once. So let's defend, hit him, and defend, and just see what happens. Okay, yeah. So I could probably hit him with Ryu and Nina, as long as no one gets a critical. Uh, which Nina will get an extra turn. And then after this, I need to start healing him back up. I don't actually know who's faster at this point. Uh, I'm pretty sure Ryu is faster. He might actually be able to take a hit from Momo. Okay, so he's going to... Uh, he's taking up that defense formation, which is the formation where I want to hit him a bunch. Uh, unfortunately, he doesn't seem to really give any indication of whether or not he's going to do that. But that is how you de increase his defense, is by having him do that. So that's pretty neat. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and continue forward. Okay, cool. So he's gonna do this for a little while. So I can just keep healing him up and smacking him to increase his defense. And hurting him a bunch to increase his HP. Cool. Okay. Not quite, okay. I'll just defend here, because I can't really do much. Okay, and we have finally finished off training Ben or Bade. He actually survived that whole training night, which means he got a bunch of attacks in. He also got some defending in, so that should hopefully increase his defense quite a bit. I also did a lot of damage to him, now that I could hit him with both Nina and Ryu, and also hit him with Momo a number of times. So that should really help his... HP. He did quite a bit more damage to me too, which increases power quite a bit. So that's good. I gotta get stronger so I can get to the lighthouse, repair it before Zig. See you again tomorrow night. I do not know how many nights they give me to do this. Uh, but I guess I will continue on and find out. Let's see what the talk of the town is right now. Oh, should have gone to the wharf. Sorry about that. Let's just go talk to these people again and see if they give any indication that maybe Zig is gonna actually go and do that lighthouse here pretty soon. Okay, I do not seem to be getting any indication that uh, we have any reason not to just keep doing training. So I guess I'll do one more. Tra I'm gonna do one more training with this guy. Uh, I'm gonna have this be the last training, then I'm gonna save and just send him to the lighthouse, see what happens. I don't remember hardly any of this part of the game at all, but let, let's just do it. Okay, and with this, I think Bade should now be strong enough to possibly do the lighthouse. Tonight's results are... Hit him a bunch while he was defending. I did a lot of damage to him, and he did a lot of damage to me. So we got six more defense, six more power, and 32 more HP. So not terrible. I gotta get stronger so I can get to the lighthouse and repair before Zig. Okay, I think, I think this is probably a good spot to give him a shot here. Sorry, I think this is probably a good spot to give him a shot here, uh, so I'm gonna save real quick, probably to a separate slot, because I don't know how many nights they actually give me to do this. Um, I'm also going to re-equip myself, uh, just in case, well, just in case uh, I end up being able to go and do things as well. No, I'll stick with the Moon Sword right now. I don't like the idea of just completely obliterating my my speed. As much fun as that would be. Mm, no, we'll we'll stick you with the Waste Claw still. Uh, your Chrism is fine. Let's give you a Gauntlet. Last Domino. Get you some defense. 
And then you can stick with Magician Rod. I'm gonna go with Bracer, Glass Domino, and Mage's Robes. Okay. I should probably get myself some better equipment. Uh, but, oh well. I'm not, I'm not super concerned about it. There will come a point where I will have much better equipment rather than that I could buy rather than possibly maybe kind of better equipment, which is what I'm encountering right now. So let's save up and go talk to Aid one last time and actually go send him to the lighthouse. Oh, actually, you know what? I'm looking at my skills here. Uh, the perfect thing to have been using in this entire situation would have been backhand. Backhand is false swipe. It cannot kill. Uh, so I could just have someone with super high attack just using that over and over for no cost, would not be able to KO the guy, and then I could just have two other people healing him. So, like, I could have given this to Gar, have Gar attack, almost KO him every time, and then Ryu and Momo could just heal him back up. That probably would have been... The easier way to do this, uh, if you're playing along at home, backhand, good move to use for this. Uh, but I'm a dum-dum. Uh, the main reason I came here is because I wanted to move Steel over to Nina. That way, she can do something other than just hitting stuff with magic. And Ryu, since Steel does not damage people like Pilfer does, uh, I want Ryu always attacking, pretty much. So, Steel on Ryu... Well, it's a cool idea, because Ryu is always going to be in your party. Eh, I'd rather have it on Nina, so she has something that she can do that doesn't use MP. Because her regular attack is balls. But, anyway, let's go to the lighthouse. The lighthouse? Oh, I, I don't think I'm ready for that yet. What? What do you mean you're going to the lighthouse, babe? It's Zig here who's going, see? So just butt out, Bade. Oh, that's right. I'm the strongest, so it's me who's going to the lighthouse. You know, just because you're strong doesn't mean you have any idea of how to fix it. The point of going to the lighthouse is to fix the lighthouse. If you are all muscle, that doesn't solve anything. Okay, so this is what it is. We needed to train him up to be strong enough to defeat Zig. Who's going, Bade or the boss? The guy who has some intelligence in his brain and is able to do this, or the muscle-bound boy? Who would probably just punch it until it worked, maybe. We can probably get away with helping Bade in secret, right? Oh ho So I'm guessing I can't use, like, active attacks, but I'm... I have a feeling I might be able to do things like use magic. Uh, so, I might be able to use these sort of skills. I want to see if I can steal from him. Uh, da -da, and then, let's protect bed. Yeah, uh, actually, Momo, go ahead and... You know what? Sure. Identify Zig. Because Ryu can use Protect on on him. There we go. So he's not carrying anything. Cool, that didn't count as interfering. Or did it? Did that count as interfering? Hey, what'd I tell you? No button in. Now we gotta start over. Sheesh. Okay, that did count as interfering. Whoops, that was a little too obvious. We'll have to wait until Zig's looking the other way. Okay. Interesting. Oh, well, it just kicked me out. All right, fine. We'll, we'll do it again. We'll do it proper this time. And apparently we have to do it while people are looking the other way. So I don't know how we get that to be a thing, but... Let's get back to the battle. Okay, yeah, he's he's waving at the girl. So when he's doing that is when I probably am able to do stuff. Uh, I don't know if I'll be able to attack him. 
or if I will only be able to uh, basically help out Babe. Okay, so he does some damages. Let's continue examining. Hmm. I don't know how far my uh, ability to help extends, really. Let's defend Momo. Actually, Nina. Maybe I can blunt him? I'm, I'm not sure. Let's find out. And maybe I can heal? And maybe I can protect? Or maybe I just need to continue sitting and waiting. Yep, I needed to continue sitting and waiting. Darn it. Okay. All right, we'll come back to this battle again. So based on the fact that they're letting me do this over and over again, I'm also assuming that if you fail this, uh, it just gives you the opportunity to train again. It doesn't... I get the feeling that if you lose with this, uh, then you can probably just go back to training and come back to doing it again. I don't think it'll game over you. Or at least that's what it's feeling like in terms of how they're doing things. But you know, we, we kind of already see how this is working. So until something is different, uh, I'm just gonna speed... Oh, thanks for the lucky strike, asshole. Aha, uh -huh, okay, yeah. Well, there's, there's the thing that's different. So now he's looking the other way. Let's go ahead and power him down. Momo, go ahead and protect Bade. And Ryu, go ahead and heal Bade. I don't know why it's Zig who's looking the other way that I have to wait for. Uh, it seems to always be his uh, Highlander friend who tells me that I can't be doing things, but, you know, whatever. Okay, now he is paying attention again, so now I have to go back to defending. And now he can't hurt, because I lowered his defense, or lowered his attack and increased Zig's defense, or Bade's defense. So now he can't hurt him. Alright, cool. Uh, well, on my next turn, I will lower... Zig's defense as well. Uh, or my next opportunity to actually do things, I'll lower his defense as well. Until then, we just kind of continue doing this. Oh, well, there we go. As soon as I say something, it looks like after he gets a lucky strike is when he goes on to do this sort of stuff. Um... I don't think they'll probably let me attack directly, and I wouldn't want to do that anyway. This is a fucking duel. Uh, but I'll lower his stats. I'm fine with lowering his stats. If I had an attack increase ability, I'd be using that on Babe. But I don't, so we'll just stick with this. Now that didn't do a whole heck of a lot, but uh, I'm sure it'll be fine. Alright, let's just continue on. Hey, we got him. Cool. All right. To be fair, there wasn't a whole lot that he could do uh, after I lowered his attack, defense, and increased the defense of my own friend here, so... Oh, no, boss. I don't believe it. How could big old Zig here lose to Bade? Simple. Uh, it's called equipment. If it hadn't been for all your help, I wouldn't have been able to beat Zig. Yeah, well, I don't think I'm ever getting my silver dagger back from you, but whatever. I'm not also- I'm also not super concerned about it, then. How does it, the same old bait, a 98-pound weakling? Shadis, I want to help you. Let's take care of the guild together. Boss! Boss! Did you hear that, boss? Wake up, boss! Thank you so much, guys. I don't know what'll happen next, 
Shadows and I will work everything out somehow, together. She hasn't said anything in all of this. I haven't gotten an agreement from her. Oh my god, I'm back out here again. Can I please, please, go to the lighthouse now? I swear to the Dragon Lord, babe. How could I lose with a body like this? It's because you don't use equipment. I'm a man, I can take it. Oh, but you guys have treasure chests. And <laughs> Oh, thank you so much for everything. You are beat the hell up. These injuries? Oh, I'm not used to fighting, so... I won't be going to the lighthouse for a while, I guess. Can we please go to it, though? But if you're really in a hurry, I really shouldn't do this, but you're not guild members. Uh, but I was wondering, would you help us fix the lighthouse? Yes, please. Momo's very good with machines. She's probably the most qualified person here. I got a guild badge. I'm now technically part of the guild. I can now go to the lighthouse. I don't know if we're sure if the ship will come back once the lighthouse is fixed, but I can't hurt to try. Thank you. I have a feeling Baden and I will get along great together. Is this the equipment I gave him? I got a scram sax. And a ranger guard. This is not the equipment I gave him. This is probably the equipment that I was supposed to give him. Uh, supposed to buy and give to him. But it's not. Because I gave him other shit that wasn't as good. <laughs> uh, but I suppose a ranger guard probably isn't a bad thing for Ryu. I did curious his agility by one and increases his defense by two. This is kind of what I meant by I don't really see the point in giving him in buying a lot of this equipment right now because it's not that much better than what I've already got in most ways. So I think I think I'm just good. I think I'm good to go. I think I'm just gonna leave. And go to your freaking lighthouse. Get out of my way. Uh, how do I get to here? Will you let me through now that I have a badge? Wait a minute, please. Only guild members. I have a guild badge. You got a badge? Oh, you're associates of the guild. Okay, but the lighthouse is full of monsters. Be careful. Thank you kindly. Okay. We have finally finished all the side quests. We can finally go to the lighthouse. I need to save badly. And I will see you guys in our next episode of Breath of Fire 3, where we actually go to the lighthouse. Finally. <laughs>